joining us today and tomorrow we're going to be in verse 13 of chapter 24, verse 13. And it says, but he, but, but the one who endures to the end shall be saved. So we're going to talk about endurance because we know that once we start doing what the Lord has asked us to do, what he's called us to do, the devil gets busy. The devil wants to do something. If he can't stop us, he at least wants to slow us down. So we're going to say we're not going to be slowed down by these things. And we've talked about this many times, but we're going to talk about it again. And because we have to endure, because the spirit of fear will come upon us and say that we can't do it. But I said that we can. The spirit of doubt will come and say that we shouldn't even try, but we should. We should do those things that God has called us to do, stand on his promises, stand on his power, and know that he is able to bring us through. So we are not going to sit back and let those spirits that tend to want to slow us down come and slow down our progress as we follow the Lord. No, we're going to keep it moving. We're going to not slow down because he's called us. But we talked the last two weeks from the book of Ezra about building. And once we build, we have to keep moving. We have to keep moving forward. There is so much. This world is losing ground to the, the, the Jesus is losing ground in this world daily. People are talking about how much they love Jesus, and yet they're so filled with hate. We have to get to the point where Jesus is still love, that we love one another, that we show this love for one another, that we don't stop, we don't slow down, because he is saying that we, if we endure, we shall be saved. Today we're going to talk about some of the things that, that, we, that slows us down, doubt and fear, a couple of them. And tomorrow we're going to talk about some of the things we're going to need to endure. So thank you for joining us. We'll see you again tomorrow.